Across the board, Sunset Overdrive has really good reviews, which makes sense since this comes from the creators of Ratchet and Clank. At first glance, this game looks great. I mean, look at it. It's colorful, energetic. It just looks fucking awesome. Unfortunately, there are some fundamental flaws of the game. For starters, the audio in the game is just awful. Like, listen to this. I'd like to meet the person who listens to this on their way to work. When the game isn't playing some 41 middies, the game finds other ways to nag it. Tactical nuke! Incoming! Yeah, they got League of Legends on this, yeah. Wait, what am I looking at? Something about this doesn't feel right. It's hard to believe this game was a launch title for the Xbox. I mean, it's got a few bugs, but it's just so fun on a basic level. 64 players, tanks, planes, helicopters. It's not a groundbreaking game by any means, but if you just want to relax, not think, and have some fun, you can always go back. This game just gave me a reward for looking at players. Now, I know this isn't an Xbox One exclusive, but I like to put on some TV while I play this game. He looks like a John Cena big ass water head cracker. <laughs> Gills, shut your Mr. Potato Head looking ass up, your lips falling off your face, dying fate. If you're looking for a good friend to play with on Xbox Live, add uh, this guy to your friends list. He's a really good player. Oh. This looks interesting. Yeah, like, this is this is my kind of gun right here. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. Flashlight? Yes. Grip? Yes. <laughs> I will never see this coming. Oh, ooh. Ooh. All right, that's it. You're gonna make me do something I didn't want to do. The pink gun strikes again. Hey, baby, get on my car. Okay, get on I get my on car, that baby. Where are you taking me? I give this game a misogyny out of 10. This game doesn't have sexuality at all. Yeah, turn the turn the trebuchet. Well, it's the thought that counts. Oh boy, can't wait to play this game for the hundredth time. My favorite part of the game is uh, the part in the dark labyrinth of a spaceship. I mean, who designed this anyway? Now the remaster of Halo 2 is clearly just a reskin. They just put a model over the pre-existing 3D render. Now, if, you, if you know me at all, if you know me in person, you know that I always think the original is better. You just can't beat it. Put on the original. Put it on. Yeah, it looks much better. All right, all right, I am sick of this Banshee. No, no, fuck you, this is mine now. This game, this entire game is mine now.